Hey everybody, welcome back to the adventures of Dooley and McQueen, two super detectives who investigate the dark side. We now have to go into police farce. Today is my day away from cases to catch up on paperwork. Bull Loney. Here we go. Oh, we're actually at the office. Wow. You ready, detective? The office. We're at the office, aka police station. Huh? For McNugget's retirement party. <laughs> the caterer has arrived with the cake. Grab your gift, let's go. What do you mean, gift? I thought you'd forget. Don't worry, I put my name... I put your name on my gift. It's from both of us. Okay, so now we can actually investigate this scene. My notes from open cases, a downtown ghoulie man, possibly undead flasher. Mirror Jane, a woman appearing in mirrors to other women who look exactly like her, of course. Lycan Toupee, a wig made from werewolf hair, which turns others into werewolves when worn. Maybe that should be werewolves? Nice. This is my life now. Dick Brickman. This is Twin Lakes FM, featuring me, Dick Brickman. Bringing you, Dick Brickman Presents the Weather, with me, Dick Brickman. It's raining. Tune in later for me, Dick Brickman, presenting Dick Brickman's Tricky Kicks Dicks. Featuring me, Dick Brickman. When all this dark side stuff is put to bed, I'm gonna see the whole world. I actually don't know what's in these. The keys were lost before they this became my office. Uh, my trusty coat goes with everything from shirt and tie to sportswear. This computer's been with me since the beginning. The budget won't allow for an upgrade. My folders of weird goings on in Twin Lakes. Hurry up, cake! Alright, you got a point. Coffee machine? Nothing beats first cup of coffee. If only I had a slice of pie to go with it. Gurgle, gurgle, gurgle. Got coffee, okay. That's good. Glass of cold, refreshing. Nope, this is warm and oddly colored. <laughs> McQueen's office, McKing. <laughs> of course. Of course, there's a McKing. Do you think I'll have my own office someday? Man, I hope so, buddy. I hope so. Dooley, you deserve it. Oh, shit. This guy's office is way nicer than mine. Best hair on the force. Okay, I'll give him that one. This is him here. McKing and the chief. <laughs> I guess these are the photos you get when you're married to the mayor. Oh, cool. That's funny. He does have great hair. Look at ours. Ours is only about 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15 pixels. He's got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18 pixels of hair. Way better. This one looks homemade. Best at not being McQueen. Oh, God. The king won this for being the best diver on the force. I don't recall anyone else being allowed to partake. Hey, we got a helmet trophy. Okay. Fancy chair. Supports backs. Fancy. His machine has an off button. Good. I wish. It's full of signed pictures of my king, of course. Pottery wheel? There's space in here for a pottery wheel? Exactly my thoughts. But, we did get some weird helmet trophy that will probably come in handy never. Broken wall? I remember this place being so run down. Busted fan? Why is this broken? Maybe the motor's bust? I'll have to look at this later. Oh, we got fan motor. Okay, I did not... Okay. Cool. Bullpen. Empty desk. Headphone wires. Broken wires. Mirakami won't care if they're gone. We are picking up all sorts of stuff. Seems Hirakami has set a new high score in whatever he's playing. Damn it, how am I meant to get better than him if you keep making me do work? Tell me that, eh? The pressure seems gone. I should fix it before it's needed. So now we got a bust. Fire extinguisher. I don't suppose... I'd be out of work if Chief Scully found me doing that. Uh, we'll just keep them for now. Officer Wazinski? No talk, working. Wow, oh, friendly as ever was in skate. Go away. All right. Cool. Stairwell, briefing room. Hello. Whoa! There's a fire in here. I meant to say surprise detective, not fire. Dooley, the gifts are on fire, literally. They sure are impressive. Can we use this little remaining thing? We need to repressurize it. Can we do a fan motor thing? Doesn't look like it. Okay. 
Let's talk to these guys first. We'll put out the fire later. Obviously, that's priority. Dooley, there's a fire. This party's on fire. Of course. Chief Scully. Chief, do you see the fire? Here we go. I've told you, detective, before. I can't solve every little thing for you. Honestly, it's... I've uncovered a crime ring. This, and... I've lost my gun. That, with you lot. Well, not today. I'm relaxing, and I'm having a drink. Yeah, but... In silence, detective. In silence. Mirakami. I love all the booze we have at these things. What about the fire? Keep complaining to yourself, Killjoy. <laughs> the hiccup. Detective McNugget. Two days left to retirement, and I'm in a room with an uncontrollable fire. Uh, just like the old gypsy woman said. Of course. We use the same banner for every retirement. Yeah, budget's got to be cut somewhere, detective. Do slash budgets explain why the sprinkler system isn't putting out that fire? That's interesting. Why don't you go do some detecting, detective? Whipped cream? Hey, I wanted extra whipped cream on my slice. Hey, we got whipped cream. Oh, can we repressurize with this? I can 100% say this is not something I expected to do today. However, that is literally genius. Whoosh. Now that that's taken care of. Wait, what's that? Whoa, what's what? It's the donut and coffee, Rhoda. It's important stuff. I'm gonna devour that cake. Hands off, officer. We're not cutting into it yet. Yeah, but chief! Pile of gifts. That urn. What urn? This urn? That, that's an urn? You mean our gift? Dooley, where did you get that? In the mysterious Chinese shop we visited last week. Investigated. We investigated it for gremlins. That seems like racial profiling to me. Dooley, you clearly had gremlins, which you then bought and brought to the station. Well then, case closed. Dooley, the lid was burned off. The gremlins are missing. And the station is crumbling apart. Yeah, like I said, case closed. Dooley, we need to find them before somebody gets hurt. Here, take this. But cake! Gremlin urn. Okay, so he's carrying the gremlin urn. We need to find those gremlins, Dooley. From some... From what I can see, nobody else got him anything nice anyways. Okay, pinboard, takeout menus. In fact, I'm seeing nothing work-related here at all. It's a party guy, relax. All right. I'm gonna tear that cake a new one. Of course. Stairwell? McKing. <laughs> and then he said, Hey, that's my kid's candy. Give it back. So I told him I was the mayor's husband, then showed him my badge and fined him for obstruction of justice. Oh, you're so bad. I see what's going on here, McKing. That'll be us one day, detective. You'll be McKing and I'll be Dallas. Okay. You know what I mean. They're close. Of course. Must be so great for you guys to have a real detective like McKing around here to learn from. Look, I don't have time to talk to you. Isn't there a Wookiee or something you should be arresting? That's not what- whatever, McLame. <laughs> McLame? You can call you the same thing. Live long and prosper, dork. Alright. Staff bathroom. So horrible, only people enter- People only enter for the most dire of emergencies. Evidence room. Reception. Because we came from the bullpen. Garage. Shooting range. Jesus. Evidence room. Hands off, McLean. Something's broken the evidence door. Probably you and your idiot sidekick's fault. I'm gonna fix it with my manly skills and muscles. If you really want to help, you could fetch you some more coffee. No need for sugar. Dallas has enough sweetness for me. Oh, you're so bad. I hate that man. Yeah, but he's so dreamy. Have your goddamn coffee, McKean. I knew you were good for something, McLean. Hands off, McLean. Something's broken the evidence door. Probably you and your idiot sidekick's fault. Well, if you really want to help, you can fetch me some more coffee. I did. I did, though. God damn it. Now I just don't have coffee. Now I'm out of coffee. Okay. Another fire extinguisher. Now they don't need it. I find a working one, of course. First aid. Nothing special in here but laxatives. Yeah, uh, somebody's put them there to suggest us cops are all full of sh Twin Lakes Police Department. How can I direct your call? We got laxatives. Oh, shit. 
We gotta mix the laxative with the coffee. We gotta get another coffee. Officer Cal. He's meant to be a sniffer dog, but somebody decided to train him only to sniff out candy. Yeah, but think of all the candy-related crimes he's been able to help solve. That's true, we did have an alarmingly high rate of candy smuggling in Twin Lakes. Good job, officer. Good boy. Hands off. My lunch is in there. Why is it hidden in the work files? So nobody will touch it? You're a wise man, Banks. What do you want, detective? Can't you see I got a reception desk to recept at? Banks was my mentor when I joined the force. That's why they busted me down to desk cop. Of course. Dispatch. This is the first bit of actual police work I've seen in this place today. Doesn't seem like it's going well. I don't know much about how this worked, but I know that's not right. Here's a gremlin dicking around. I uh, can't talk right now, detective. This is broken. I can't figure out why. Yummy, yummy wires. It's uh, trying to hack into the database and steal all the human info. We should try him, detective. Interesting idea. Uh, wires? Be out of work. Service for the TLP. <laughs> Ouch! Don't get too close, detective. That thing's got a. That thing is a biter. I mean, he just. I just got. Yeah, thanks, Dooley. Thumbs up. All right. So. Hmm. It's a trophy. I would need an air supply before I could function as an actual helmet. Oh, okay. Be able to work there. I just want to see if any of these combine. Doesn't look like it. So how do we... Hmm. It's a mug. A normal run-of-the-mill mug. I don't know why I feel this need to comment on every item in the room. <laughs> Friday evening, 7 p.m., but crime never sleeps. Us? Well, we take shifts, and we're off on public holidays. Yeah, I gotta take those rest days, detective. Okay, so we're gonna have to come back. Holding cells. Let's see what's down here. Holding cell one. There's a rat. This guy's in police protection for informing. We put that up to cover a hole a prisoner dug to escape. Sadly for him, he dug his way into the rest of the station. Nice. Trying to toilet your incarceration, let you down, get you down. That was terrible. Number two. Oh, hello. Roy. Detective. I'm gonna use my detectiving skills and say you're in for solicitation. It's impressive. Your guess, not his soliciting. Right, anyway, hand them over, Roy. Hand what over? Your matches and cigars. I wish I'd never met you, detective. Okay, so we got matches. More matches from Busty Bells. Inevitable outcome to this item that I don't love. Headphone wires. Reminder of what to get him for his birthday. There's a magnet in here, if I can find a way to pop open the tiny latch. Okay, so we need a magnet for some reason. Apart from the hole in the air supply, McKing's trophy is actually a working airtight helmet. If I found a tube, I could get this back in action. Alright. Holding cell three. Oh, Tam! Tam puts his name places so he knows what's his what's not. Remember Tam? Old Tam loves to whittle. Whittle, whittle, whittle. Tam, you can't have a knife in prison. Tam can and Tam has. I'm afraid I have to confiscate that. Tam does not have warmth for you in his heart. Sorry, Tam. Did you hear? No, I'm not doing this. I just don't find toilets all that funny. <laughs> okay, we have a bunch of stuff here. Uh, maybe we could pry this open, get the magnet. It's too big. I need to find something smaller. That's what she said. Too easy. The hose they used to loop around the cell door handles and lock the place up at night. <sighs> Chief Scully really pulled this place into a sort of order, didn't she? And now we got a hose. Which we can combine with this, right? Plugging this into here gives me diving helmet. Yep. Okay, we're getting a lot of things. We're getting a lot of stuff. I need to go get another coffee. That's that's what I'm gonna do. Gurgle, gurgle, gurgle. Get the coffee. Laxative coffee. Spiked coffee. Back to McDork here. I don't have time to talk to you. Isn't there a Wookiee or something you should be arresting? Whatever, McLame. Live long and prosper, dork. Here, I got a coffee for you, buddy. <laughs> Keep the coffee coming, McLame. I can drink this stuff all day. Oh, he turned green. Get out of my way. Karma. I hope he's okay in there. The people of Twin Lakes need a hero to look up to. 
My insides, make it stop, bro. Peace. Now to fix this with my manly skills and muscles, but mostly by finding a way to cheat this magnetic lock. Oh, okay, that's what we need the magnet for. So we need something to pry open this to get the magnet. Shooting range, garage. Let's go shooting range. Coerce is a gremlin here. Keeps hitting that spot while shooting at us. We need something stronger to hide behind. Okay. Looks like our guys are good enough shots to be stormtroopers. How did I get a gun? Why is everything so unsafe in this station? Beauty, pew, 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 he. All right, junction box, junction box. Fuck, of course. They're bust. If I want them to work again, I need to fix the system in the basement. Good to know. Uh, good to know. Garage. McQueen's car. Our government issued block with wheels. Hmm, dispatch the junction box is screwed closed. Can I unscrew it with this? Have you ever tried to, I don't know, open something with that with just using like a screwdriver? I've always been more of like a lateral thinker. Of course. And we got wires. Okay, let's see. Tinker, what the frick? I need to drag the wires from one node to the other same colored node. Without crossing them. Okay. Uh, if we go down like this. Oh, interesting. Because, like, how do you... Maybe, like, something like this. No. Uh, wow. So if we do that, there's no way to get inside there. Oh, we can go like this. And then around like this. Cool. Got him! One gremlin down. <laughs> yeah, the system's back online. Time to do some hardcore cop work. Okay, that should have shocked the monster in the dispatch. I should get it before it wakes up. Yes, yes you should. Oh, look at McKing's car. Badass. Seriously, why does he get all these nice things? A bulletproof sports car? It's a jerk. There's a serious draft coming in from those vents. The bolts probably just need to be tightened up. Serious draft. <laughs> hey, I tried. Construction site? Water valves. Let's get the water flowing again in case another fire starts. Holy shit, the pipes run all over the station from the briefing room to the shooting range. But the system seems broken right now, probably the gremlin's fault. Okay, at least it's one of these. Uh, we can also just work from here. See where this gets us. There we go. The sprinkler should be working now. Y'all have me out of work, you will. <laughs> I don't know what that was, to be honest with you. Do we need both? I don't want to mess with it now that it's working. Okay, good. Spare pipes from the work that's happening. Pot of clay. Ooh, for the, for the office. A lump of cold, hard clay. I have no use for this right now. Okay. I think the tiny picket fences really make this place seem homely. It's a great addition by the chief. You don't look very busy. Yeah, power to the bus, so Union says they don't work. Now my place to go against Union. You seem familiar. Do I know you? Oh, look at the look at the resemblance. Look at the resemblance. Sideburns match. Ish. Not really. His are longer. Now that I know of no. What are you reading? Oh yeah, this uh this is not really. Just book out from the library. Late fees. Him in the library. Uh Okay. Proper see me stuff this. Dooley, is that... Is that you on the cover in a Fabio wig? I, uh... Look, those crews aren't gonna catch themselves, are they, Detective? Dooley. This is what happens when I can't talk my way out of... Late fees. There are monsters to catch, Detective. That's funny. Mind if I borrow this? Yeah, why not? I can't see me getting back to work on time any soon. Monkey wrench. Can we... Do anything with this? If I crush the shell open, I could damage the magnet. I need to find something more delicate. 
Yes, something more delicate. Okay. Reception, dispatch, gremlin. It's passed out, let's get it out of here. So we gotta dispatch gremlin. <laughs> All right. Um, we do have the water now, but. Things are fixed, but I need something to act. Oh. It should achieve something. It did. The creature's, uh, wet. I don't know why I expected more from that. I did too, to be fair. Now it's armed and wet. Maybe if we wait around long enough, it'll catch a cold. What if we throw another gremlin at it? Good smelly fight, beep, beep, you. Throw the wrench at it? No. Diving helmet. I'm only putting this on somewhere where nobody will see me. Oh. Okay, I'm not sure how to dispose of him just yet. My insides! Um... Monkey wrench. Can we break this? No. There's space in here for the pottery wheel. We had that pottery clay, but... Still working. What about back here? You guys good? Detective. Oh, here we go. Didn't you see the fire chief? Of course, it was right there. Why didn't you do anything? What can I do? If people want to re-gift the fires I got them last month, let them let them. Wait, you were the one who set those fires around the station last month? They were beacons of hope, all very metaphorical. They were real fires. Metaphors can be real. Why is McKing's office so much nicer than mine? You think our barely legal goblins and ghouls division should have a bigger office than the mayor's husband? Just be glad you're not down in the basement. Thanks for supporting the dark side division, chief. Don't thank me, just keep the city clean. Those oogie boogie men. And the oogie boogie women. The non-binary oogie boogies. No discrimination in regards to oogie boogies. Except for the discrimination of keeping them out of Twin Lakes. Apart from that one, yes. I think there might be gremlins loose in the station. Seriously, we just talked about this. You have one job. One job. No oogie boogies in Twin Lakes. The station is in Twin Lakes. Get the situation under control, detective. On it, chief. No party for you two until this place, this mess is cleaned up. Get to it. Oh. I don't understand why we're celebrating yet. I've got two days left to retirement. We can't risk you not making it and us losing out on a party. I should be offended, but I do like a good party. All right. Uh, okay, now what do we need to do here? Oh, wait. No, we need to get the magnet out of here, but we need to find something so we can get into the evidence room. So we need something small. Uh... Just seeing if any of those combine. What? I wonder if we have anything like on a desk. Let's go back in here. Gift for my old mentor, Sergeant McDesk. A lot of mix. A lot of mix. Uh, what's in the bin? Various attempts to file reports for the things I've seen. Hmm. Nothing in here that I can see to open up the fan motor. Let's check McQueen McKing's again. No. Okay. No more coffee. I don't think we need to... Oh! Wait a second. Oh no, wait. At least now it's broken because it took the motor, right. Yeah, 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 yeah. We knew that. Okay, debrief room, nothing in there, as far as I can tell. Evidence room, we need to get that magnet. What if I scare her with the gremlin? I don't like like seeing me at that. Hmm. Meant to be a sniffer dog, somebody decided to train to sniff out candy. I wonder if he can get into this. Nope. 
in dispatch. Let's talk to Renell. Can't talk now. System back online. There are people who need our help. Hands off. They just came back online and went with some failing again. Glad that's fixed. Okay. Do we see anybody? Please protection for informing. Can you chew this open? Hey, you never know. Nope. Do you know anything about opening this? No. Okay. So that's clear. Now how do I... What if we put it... No. Okay. I am honestly not sure what I'm doing. It's a good aim. We should get it on the force. Like, we probably need to put something there, I would guess. What that is, I have no idea. Maybe something with this air vent? I'm sure that if I didn't remove this now, it would fall off soon anyway. Nice. Neither of us believes that, but I'm into this. Fight the system. Duly, we're part of the system. Speak for yourself and bring the place down from the inside. I kind of knew that. Oh, uh, oops. I did not expect that to happen. <laughs> Feel bad about it? No. I'll take this for my trophy cabinet. I mean, uh, I take it to be repaired. Yeah, the second one. How do you get all these things into your pockets? Great question. Origami? Basically. We got a hood. What? Say the vent broke, some maverick cop was crawling through it. Uh, maybe we, oh, maybe we use this to block the, um, yeah, it's bulletproof, so we use that to block. Got nothing else in there. Okay, let's go block the other gremlin. I just have to angle it like this. Nice. <laughs> okay, that was a shocking way to wrap this up. You proud of that pun? Yeah, more than I should be. Finally, do the grab the gun and I'll take this guy. Shooting range gremlin. Okay, so those are the two gremlins. At least the gremlin's out cold. Now maybe we can go back to the debriefing room. Detective. We got the gremlins. What if we show her this? I don't want my colleagues seeing me at that. What? So... No party for you until this mess is cleaned up. Just when you think you're making progress. Can I wear this in here? Or nobody will see me? Okay, I'm not sure what the frick we need to be doing. That said, uh, I'll take a break here and then when we come back, we'll continue figuring this out. Okay? Sounds good? Wish me luck. Next time on Dooley and Tooley. Bye. <laughs>